Yes, you read that title correctly. This is going to be a step-by-step -step guide on how to play Modern Warfare for all you Black Friday noobs. Okay guys, to begin with, you're going to want to load up Ground War, and if you are in the map Karst River Quarry, you are going to want to grab this tank right here. Yes, this tank, don't grab an APC, or this will happen to you. Secondly, you're gonna want to make your way up this hill. Yes, this hill is gonna be on your left if you're spawning on east side and it is gonna be on your right if you're spawning on a side. Once you've reached the top of the hill, you are simply going to tactically wait for the enemy. And that is all guys. Once you've made your way to the top, you'll be on a killing spree and no one will stop you. If for some reason people do try to stop you like this missile right here, simply back your tank up down the hill and it will miss i'm gonna show that one more time guys you're gonna take your tank and back up and boom the missile misses okay so you didn't get cars for quarry no problem at all if you are in the tavorsk district slowly make your way up to this building right here and go up the elevator chute Okay, now that you've made your way to the top, make sure you have the perk that allows you to have two claymores. Yes, you're going to want two claymores, a gun of your choice, and a deployable shield. You will place those two claymores over there in those two spots I showed you, and then you will place your deployable shield right here in front of the elevator. That is all that you will need to do for this spot, and now you tactically wait for the enemy. Okay, so you guys got a kill with your claymore. If that happens to be the case, pick up this claymore right here and place it back down where the last one was and continue tactically waiting. Eventually, an enemy will pop up. Eventually. Just like I said, guys, here is our first enemy. Okay, so you don't really like ground war and you're not a fan of tactically waiting. That's okay. Just make this custom loadout right here. Make sure you have the Assault Shield, the .357 with these attachments, and make sure you have the Snake Shot Ammunition Rounds. That is what is going to make this weapon the beast of a weapon, and it is the best shotgun, quote-unquote, in the game. The perks that you'll be running is EOD, Ghost, and Battle Hardened, and for your Lethal, a C4, and for your Tactical, a Stim Shot. If you guys are wondering what kind of field upgrades I run, I mainly run Dead Silence, but you could also run the Munitions Box. And if by any chance you guys want to see gameplay of the .357, here it is right here. As you can see, this weapon is a beast at what it does. If you find yourself in any trouble like this, you can just use your C4 to get yourself out of it. And that will wrap up everything for today's video, guys. If you still have not caught on, this video was made entirely as a joke. Please do not actually use any of the advice I had given you unless you want to piss everyone off. Thank you and have a great rest of your day.